Hey guys, Rexon here. Welcome back to another video. And today I'm going to be showcasing the Rexon paid mod menu. And before you click off the video, if you're looking for a free mod menu, they um, also have a free mod menu, Rexon Free, which is basically just as good of kick mods and a ton of other cool stuff. The best free mod menu there is. But yeah, it has um, undetected laggers, undetected crashers, undetected kickers. It has um, break um, others' audio so they like, can't hear their footsteps. Um, it has so much cool stuff like working anti-report, everything. Anything you could ever ask for, really overpowered, good for ghost trolling. So yeah, um, if you want any of these menus, it's going to be in the Discord server in the description. Discord.gg slash Rexon. So yeah, uh, let's start the showcase. Okay, so first we start with the basic mods. Switch menu hands, it'll put it to my left hand. Left trigger disconnect, when I click my left trigger when this is on, it'll disconnect me from the room. Join random, this joins a completely random room, random game mode, random map, you know. Um, um, join random ghost code, it basically will queue you up for all the ghost codes like DayZ09, DayZ, PPPV, all of them. So whenever any of them get free, like, you know, there's like one free spot, you'll join it. So you don't have to go through like the effort of trying to join a code when it's like full. Um, platforms, just normal platforms, the rainbow. Um, network platforms, when you have this on, you can basically see other Rexon users' platforms and you can touch them or whatever. Uh, most speed boosts, it just gives you like a small unnoticeable speed boost. So pretty cool. Um, rig mods, invis monkey right secondary. It's like the upper right bu thumb button. So yeah, it makes you invis. Uh, ghost monkey left secondary, you just go ghost. Um, no clip monkey is left trigger. You can go through stuff. So yeah, um, fly monkey right secondary. This is like a fly monkey. Mute gun. It it's only on your end, but when you shoot someone, oh, if you shoot someone, they're gonna be muted on the leaderboard for you, and you know you can unmute them, whatever. First person camera. This is gonna mess up my camera mod, like this thing. But uh, yeah, yeah, <laughs> I'm not gonna use it. No control vibrations. It basically when you have it on you like can't feel your vibration. So I don't know if you just don't like the vibrations or someone's using vibrate others, you could turn that on. Um, Anti-mod checker, well mod checkers are broken too, whatever, ignore that. Point gun, basically what happens when you shoot someone and hold it on them, your rig is gonna be like ghost monkey. It's gonna like rotate like towards them and face them. Good for ghost trolling. RGB monkey, uh, this is a little inconsistent. I'm gonna fix in the next update, but it sometimes works, sometimes it doesn't, but you have to be in stump. So yeah. Um, Disable other rig lurping. It basically makes it so the rigs like isn't smooth like it's just like the raw movements If you know what that means um, this um, steam lawn arms just right trigger for uh, lawn arms Le left for the short arms Yeah, uh, and auto steam lawn arms is just like a preset like a certain length If you just you know, whatever uh, head spin I'm going uh, flip basically. It's um, just spins your head all server-sided upside down head you upside down head. Rotate head to nearest player. I'm gonna go into a um, I'm gonna go into a public lobby for this because it's actually really cool and it works server sided. What it does is it basically like rotates your head to like whoever is closest to you. So it's like really creepy. Like you should see, it's like really scary. Yo black, look. Yo black, look, look. Yo, do you see that? Yo, what's up, guys? Wait, how are you? You're not Yo, hey, is this Bubba creepy, Bubba? bro? Is this creepy? Oh, okay. it just shows you're using your Molly's PC. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but it works. And then we have Spaz Monkey. Oh, yeah, you have to be in a room. My bad. <sighs> Alright. So, Spaz Monkey just spazzes your rig out. Silent hand taps. No hand taps. Server sided. Loud hand taps. I think this is client sided. Uh -huh. Rapid hand taps. Just fast hand taps, so it's like good for like wall running, or whatever. Um, yeah, this guy's a nerd. Fake lag self, it basically makes it look like you're lagging, even though you're not. PSA simulator, basically when you click your right secondary, you move forwards, like that. So it's like you're walking in your play space. Play space abuse, whatever. Wall walk, right grip, it basically makes you look good. Like, you know, it'll help you go up the walls. Um, no finger movement. Basically makes you have no, like, movements when you click those buttons. Platform wall walk. Um, basically, it's like using platforms to wall walk. So, it looks a little bit less unlegit. Uh, oh, yeah, I'm lagging. Hold on. But, yeah, you can see it, like, kind of works. It's still, like, beta testing. Rig dupe, that doesn't work. Just ignore that. Um, then we have tag mods. And you go into infection. But, uh, basically... Tag this nearest player. It's moving you towards like the nearest like untagged person. It'll help you tag them if you're bad. Tag self. If you're not tagged, it'll just like tag you. Tag aura. 
basically anyone in this like red like radius if they're inside of it then it will like just tag them automatically let me show you guys what that looks like so if you see that untagged person there it just teleports my hands to him and yeah tag all right trigger it will just tag everyone in the room here why didn't it? oh yeah tag that one all right tag gun basically just tags one person all right this will be a good time to use the tag self wait a second for them to load all right all right when they're moving around also it's a little bit hard to get tagged but tag gun you just shoot them and tags them yeah, that's it for the tag mods um visual mods oh, yeah don't worry i have an anti-report i just have it off right now because i want to be able to use it in publics so and whatever I i'm fine with being banned but uh you should probably keep it on all right server side tracers it doesn't work uh tracers just normal ones if they're not tagged it's um green if they are tagged it's red uh modern tracers uh well modern you can't really detect it so it's broken esp is just box esp it's like the tracers but yeah boxes ambush uh, ambush was removed so yeah, that's enough for the visual mods safety mods no name it basically gives you no name on the leaderboard it says blank it, it is kind of like hard to use like sometimes you have to rejoin the code or yeah, it's kind of like buggy so i won't be using it now but it does work i tested it um then we have anti report so basically oh yeah we can turn off the answer whatever anti report visualizer but if somebody puts their hand near like your report button like right now from like the distance that i have if they get it within here you'll leave the room and by changing this distance with left right triggers when it's on that like distance where their hand has to be changes yeah it doesn't like false flag up to you Whoa. so yeah like this is distance now make smaller hey, you, you, you. turn it off and then enter board visualizer just turn you know it turns that yeah. on off anti-anti cheat report basically prevents the anti-cheat from reporting you so it'll help you not get banned. Anti-RPC ban. I mean, it does kind of work. Not really. Uh, it's really buggy. But you can use it if you want. I don't think it's detected. So it's whatever. Turn off anti report. Now we have world mods. So rope stuff. Let's go to canyons. And yeah, this is all server-sided. All right. So first we have uh, ropes up. Makes them go up. Get your reaction. You, you can see them moving. Yeah, they're it's server sided. Ropes down, it makes them go down. Freeze ropes. It is kind of bad, but like, you know, freezes them. Spaz ropes. Spazzes them. Ropes to self, they all go to you. Uh, this is do not use. Water splash shell. Alright, now when we have legit speed boost, you have to click both grips. It basically like, moves you, like flicks at the floor, so you can make it look legit. Uh, then we have apply index gravity to self. This basically just makes your gravity whatever the number below is. So one is normal. Say two would be, you know, two times gravity. So you, you could tell it's, you know, extra low. And 0 0.5 would be uh, to like, like, to like less low gravity. So, you know, you're low gravity. And you could just disable it to go back to normal. And then 45 hertz. It just makes your game like a little laggy. Like... It gives you 45 hertz so like you can become really good at um wall running like vertical whatever like ah. oh hold on i suck oh, uh. yeah you see it's like a lot easier um backtrack it is kind of broken but it's basically just like a really yeah no it's really creepy i i meant it to be something else but now it's just like an abomination so yeah and then we have fling on not working loud mic all these mic mods um they're not working i'm pretty sure i know how to fix them but i haven't really done anything all right so um these do work the mine stuff well lucy isn't here anymore so unfortunately um it doesn't really work well is she here i don't remember but yeah it basically it, they do work so yeah it's like summoning it and whatever um you mind just more like lucy mods you can just read if you want that sigma fire gun quote it doesn't really work just ignore this it's a really bad boost fps um i'm not gonna turn it on because you can't turn it off but it basically makes all the textures and stuff really low quality so your fps does go by up like 10 or something which isn't you might not think it's a lot but going from like say 10 fps to 20 really like you know makes you feel a lot better so um, so, um now we have projectile mods uh you have to be in a room for these to work but you can change the color i'll just keep it on rainbow the speed and i'll make it slow and the projectile type and impact stuff, it's not working right now because the, um, the game mode went away. Ambush is not here anymore. Um, 
I actually might fix this actually I'm pretty sure I know how to so you know expect the impact stuff to come back projectile type for now this doesn't work but yeah now that you have your settings up you can get projectile minigun and you have to be in a room by the way uh, the stuff doesn't need to load like the game needs to load like give it a bit and then it'll work but yeah like you can tell I'll show you the server side yo purple purple bro can you see these snowballs can you see them Yo, dude, can you see these? Can you see these? Or stop jumping. Yo, bro, can you see these projectiles? Like the snowballs. Yeah. And then we have projectile spammer. They are kind of slow. I'm gonna fix that. Projectile rain. Projectile fountain. Shoot projectiles at nearest player. Impact, and then the impact Hi. stuff is uh, broken. Poop. It just makes you poop. And then key. PNM. And then after projectile mods, we have OP mods. Yay. All right. So allow possibly detected mods to run. Um, I recommend, like, there's a bunch of mods here that are detected. Like, I don't want you guys to really be using them because you'll get pretty much instant banned. But if you still want to use them, uh, just turn this on and it'll allow you to use them. Kick all um, detected because it uses anti ban. Uh, yeah, vibrate others, vibrate gun, these stuff, they do all work. You just need to be master client. So vibrate others, you like vibrate the controllers, slow others, or make it like, you know, when you get tagged, you like can't really move. It'll do that, but like permanently to them. Um, give self master client, uh, it does work, but it's uh, detected, so don't use. Ban gun, uh, I'm not actually sure if it really works. It used to work at one point, but I'm not sure the current state of it. You have to be in a room for the... Play static sound. All right, so play static sound. You have to be in a room. Oh yeah, I'm gonna make a soundboard, like an actual one soon, so that'd be cool. Just does it sound. Say when I will trigger that. Um, I think it might be detected. Oh yeah, I had a new method. I forgot to add it, but I have a new undetected method. Um, I used it for something else. But basically, what this does is it makes it so you like can't go into a room, disabling you. You can't. So basically, like, say you, you know you're in forest, you want to trick someone. You can turn this on, and you can walk into canyons, and you're still in the forest lobby. See? Do -do -do -do. So yeah, pretty cool. And then spam index audio, right trigger, right grip. It basically plays whatever audio is like here. Two twelve. What? That audio? I don't know what that is. Two eleven. Some like bottom. Yeah, it all plays different audios. Break others' audios. Yo, dude, wait, touch the floor. Can you hear your hand taps? Like, can you, when you walk? No. Yeah. Oh, it is. Yeah, and then the gun it just does on one person. Break others' audio, too. That's just another one. I like it. That does it one person. All right, destroy all legal mod menus. Basically, when you're in a modded lobby, you, um, it basically, if you turn this on, all bark mod menus and everything would just disappear in all the mods. Um, float gun. Oh, yeah, I sh wow, I've had these for a while. I need to remove these, but yeah, they do not work. All of this stuff is all uh, detected. Anti ban is all detected. It's like insta ban. This all needs anti ban, so do not use any of this. This one, yeah, that's also. Wait. Yeah, I think this might be detected. I don't think it works, so don't use it. And then that detected, do not use. Hands made with This is all detected. That's client sided. I don't think it even works right now. And I'll do not use any of this. Um, and then we get to the newer mods so these mods are labeled as delay ban but from my testing i'm pretty sure they are actually undetected they it, it's really been like there and there it's like really inconsistent but if i were to go into say code three i can use it real quick so you see there's nine people in here you do have to it does make you rejoin the code like it makes you disconnect and rejoin so all right so for some reason the recording cut out so i'm going to be using the kick and lag and crash mods on my computer so yeah let's start off with the kick mods all right, so under code mods. Yeah, yeah. And we turn that on. Oh, I don't have to install the second. meta quest link app. All right, let's see what yeah. happens. So there's still uh, lagging. And all right, so as you can see, there's only uh, five people. Left. I mean, I think some of them rejoined. Yeah, you see, people got kicked. They're starting to join back, but whatever. It works. All right, so next we have the. Uh, Crash mods and lag mods. All right, so we need to go to canyons. Um, lag all. Oh yeah, I turned it on. There. So lag all. You can see they're lagging. 
and then you should wait like 10 seconds around and then crash off you can see they completely freeze it does like they yeah like look you can see they'll unfreeze and it just keeps doing it over and over and yeah all right so thanks for watching the video i gotta make the outro like this because you know I, uh, I'm playing on a computer, the video cut out, but yeah, thank you for watching, if you want the menu, it's going to be in the dis uh, link in the description, discord.gg slash rexon, and yeah, and the f there's free and a paid menu, and yeah, thanks for watching, bye bye.